Are you frustrated by missing the perfect shot because your camera just can't keep up? Maybe you've struggled with rolling shutter ruining your video footage, or dealt with unreliable autofocus that constantly hunts when you need it to lock on instantly. Well, according to multiple leaks and insider reports, Nikon has been working behind the scenes on a new flagship camera that might just solve those long-standing frustrations once and for all. The rumored Nikon Z92 is shaping up to be one of the most advanced professional mirrorless cameras ever built. This is not just another small step forward. It could represent a massive generational leap for Nikon and for the entire industry. With a stacked sensor design that eliminates rolling shutter, cutting edge autofocus powered by advanced AI, lightning fast processing, and connectivity features that push photography into the cloud era. This model could redefine what a flagship camera means in 2025. So let's dive deep into every aspect of these leaks and see whether the Nikon Z92 really has what it takes to dethrone Canon and Sony in the ongoing camera wars, a revolution at the sensor level eight. The heart of every great camera lies its sensor and Nikon knows this. The Z92 is rumored to feature a 45 megapixel stacked full frame CMOS sensor. Now, some might have expected Nikon to push beyond 50 or even 60 megapixels to directly compete with Canon's upcoming R5 Mark II or Sony's A1 Mark II, but Nikon seems to be taking a smarter approach. Instead of chasing megapixel numbers, Nikon is doubling down on speed, performance, and dynamic range. The stacked sensor architecture means dramatically faster readout speeds, effectively eliminating rolling shutter, a problem that has plagued video shooters for years. Sports photographers, action shooters, and videographers working with fast motion will finally have a tool that captures reality without distortion. The balance at 45 megapixels is also strategic. It's high enough for detailed prints, commercial photography, and professional work, but not so high that file sizes become unmanageable. In many ways, this sweet spot could make the Z92 the most versatile flagship camera on the market. New image processor, powering the future, backing up this advanced sensor is the new XPE8 image processor. This is a huge leap from the Xpeed 7 inside the Nikon Z9. This new chip isn't just about brute power, it's designed to handle massive data throughput while enabling new AI-driven photography features. That means real-time computational enhancements, more efficient noise reduction at high ISOs, and smarter tone mapping for both stills and video. What's truly exciting is how this processing power translates into workflow improvements. Leaks suggest that the Z92 could be capable of computational photography tricks we normally associate with smartphones, but executed at a professional, full-frame level. Think of things like automated HDR blending, background separation, and advanced skin tone rendering happening natively in camera. Video capabilities, cinema grade performance. Now let's talk about video, because this is where the Nikon Z92 leaks get jaw-dropping .8K video recording. Reportedly supported at 24, 25, 30, 50, and even 60 frames per second. That puts it directly in competition with high-end cinema cameras, 4K video rumored to go all the way up to 240 frames per second, unlocking buttery smooth slow motion previously reserved for specialized equipment. In-bit internal recording, meaning you won't necessarily need an external recorder for professional grade projects, saving productions both money and time. Raw video options. Multiple sources have hinted at ProRes RAW and NRAW being available internally, providing maximum flexibility for post-production workflows. For video creators, this camera could rival or even surpass hybrid monsters like the Canon EOS R5C or Sony FX3. Nikon has sometimes lagged behind in the video department, but the Z92 could completely flip that narrative. Autofocus. AI on a whole new level. Perhaps the most game-changing upgrade lies in autofocus. The Nikon Z92 is rumored to feature an AI-enhanced subject detection and tracking system that pushes the boundaries of what we've seen before. The system has been reportedly trained on millions of real-world images, giving it the ability to recognize and predict subject movement like never before. Wildlife photographers, chasing birds in flight or sports shooters capturing split-second action will see incredible improvements. Wedding. Photographers working in low-light venues or dealing with chaotic dance floor scenarios could finally rely on a Nikon, system that feels nearly predictive. Early testers even described the autofocus as borderline supernatural, with the camera anticipating 
where the subject is going to move before it happens. If this proves true, Nikon could leapfrog Sony, who currently dominates the autofocus conversation. Body design, ergonomics meet durability. While specs matter, usability is where professionals really feel the difference. The Nikon Z92 is expected to refine its physical design with several key changes. Lighter magnesium alloy body. A direct response to complaints about the weight of the Z9 during long shoots. Redesigned grip and button layout. Improved ergonomics for photographers with different hand sizes, making long sessions more comfortable. Weather sealing. Maintained at the same robust standard pros expect for harsh environments. Fully articulating LCD screen. A long requested feature that finally brings Nikon in line with Canon and Sony for flexibility in video and creative angles. For event shooters, travel photographers, and vloggers, that articulating screen alone is a major win. Storage and connectivity. Next-gen workflow. One of the most overlooked parts of modern photography is workflow. Nikon appears to be addressing that directly. Dual CFX Press Type B slots. Ensuring blazing fast write speeds and essentially eliminating buffer issues during high-speed bursts. G-Wireless Connectivity. Perhaps the boldest rumored feature. Imagine uploading massive raw files straight from the field to cloud storage or directly to client servers. For photojournalists, sports shooters, and wedding photographers, this could be revolutionary. USB-C with power delivery, likely included, meaning you can charge and transfer files rapidly, on the go. This shift toward wireless first professional workflows could set the standard for how cameras integrate with the modern cloud. Ecosystem release date and pricing, so. When will the Nikon Z92 actually hit the market? Based on multiple industry leaks and supply chain reports, the timeline looks like this. Announcement window, October, November, 2025. Shipping, possibly late 2025 or early 2026. Depending on global supply chain stability. As for price, prepare your wallets. The Z92 is rumored to launch around $5,990, which is a bump from the Z9's original $4,199 launch price. This positions it directly against the Canon EOS R1 and Sony A1 Mark II, both hovering in the 6,299-6,499 range, global inflation, tariffs, and supply issues make this pricing almost inevitable. But if the leaked specs hold true, many professionals will find the cost justified. Who is the Nikon Z9 II for? The brilliance of the Z9 II is that it seems tailored for multiple audiences. Sports and wildlife photographers. Thanks to blistering burst speeds, AI autofocus, and rolling shutter elimination, Wedding and event shooters, better low-light AF, lighter body, articulating screen, and real-time connectivity. Cinematographers and content creators, 8K60, 4K240, 10-bit internal recording, raw video options, and flexibility without needing external gear. Travel and documentary photographers, more portable build, rugged weather ceiling, and the ability to send files instantly from anywhere. This could be Nikon's most universally appealing flagship ever. Industry context, the camera wars of 2025. What makes the Z92 so exciting isn't just its specs, it's the timing. Both Canon and Sony are preparing major flagship updates for 2025. Canon's EOS R1 is rumored to focus on speed and reliability, while Sony's A1 Mark II will likely push resolution and autofocus even further. That means the Z92 won't exist in a vacuum. Instead, we're heading into what could be the most competitive flagship camera showdown in history. Professionals will be watching closely to see which system delivers on promises and which falls short. If Nikon nails autofocus, video performance, and workflow integration, the Z92 could become the gold standard for hybrid shooters. But if they stumble, especially in areas like overheating, battery life, or network reliability, Canon and Sony will happily pick up the slack. Final thoughts. The Nikon Z92 isn't just a rumored camera. It represents Nikon's statement of intent for the next decade. By combining a 45 mm stacked sensor, AI-driven autofocus, cinema-grade video, lighter ergonomics, and futuristic connectivity, Nikon could deliver a tool that reshapes professional photography and videography.